What's up, fams? Today we're doing island food here in West Sydney. Um, we've been around here five years now. From Lotus Island Food comes Aoka, which is raw fish. Pacific Island Foods out West Sydney. How long have you guys been here? Okay, Galo. Alifu. Today we're checking out this place. We're checking out Pacific Island Foods out west, out here in West Sydney. You know, what do you expect to find in, um, you know, a place where they sell um, Pacific Island foods and, and products from New Zealand as well? Oh, you know about the mayo. Best foods. That's what you got to have. you got to have the best foods. Got your, got your kalos, pa'i, bananas, green bananas, taro. It's, uh, it says 10.90 a kilo. I don't know. Is that good? <laughs> That's what's up. You know you Pacific Islander when you know this. What do you know about the corned beef? Yeah, so this shop stores a lot of um, Pacific Island food and the ingredients for Sapasui, there's Kalo, there's uh, Pisupo, you know, corned beef. And a lot of uh, products also from New Zealand, like you saw the mayo and all that kind of stuff. Yeah, we see pork buns in there. Okay, kalo. Alifu. Look at that slam there. Got the porky masima at the back. How long have you guys been here? We've been here about six years now. Six years now. Six years over here? Okay, where's, where's the other story? Oh, so it's like 15 minutes from Okay. Here. What's your background? We're Vietnamese. Vietnamese. Yeah. So Vietnamese, what do you know about Vietnamese doing island food? So this place in Lans Lansvale. Lansvale. So people, if you're ever looking for Pacific Island food, come down to Lansvale. They, these guys have got it. they got the, everything. Oh, even the pulingis. Look at this. Got the pulingis. We'll have to... Okay, gotta come on the weekend. So she said, come on the weekend, much, much more variety. So yeah, if you're ever in the area, out west, you're looking for Pacific Island food, this is one of the spots you can come and get your fix of uh, Pacific Island food. For all uh, the people watching this who've never tried Pacific Island food before, come to this place in Lansvale. You can get taro, green bananas, coconut cream, got the pobi masima, you know, salty beef. We got the uh, lamb, we got sapasui, got everything. Pulingi, you know. I don't know, maybe better than your mama's pulling you, I don't know. <laughs> Come try it out. <laughs> but that's it. Okay, so this is pork buns, and you can see. It's mm. yummy. Uh, we got a luau that's in here. We're gonna open up one. And we got a pulingi, which is basically pudding with uh, custard. And over here we have turkey tails. And that's what we got from this place in Otai. For you Tongans out there that love your Otai. A lot of eating today, so I'm um, gonna break the diet. This is the diet. So, and thank you so much. Another good place to come and pick up, um, you know, Pacific Island foods if you're in Sydney. So, if you're looking for Pacific Island food in Sydney, this is one of the spots out here, out west. Mama fan. So, come check these people out. The food looks yummy. You know, in a Pacific Island spot, when you come out here and you see a sign like this, Fa'alifu. Kekipua'a, Oka, Koko Samoa, Panipopo, Taro, Palusami, Sapasui. Wow, we got all this food to get through. Yes, I changed my glasses, because I can. <laughs> um, so big up to Parker Films for these glasses. Here, this is a blue tint. Glasses Parker Films hooked me up with uh, Allies 
eyewear, they make these glasses. So allies eyewear, make sure you people pull up on their IG, support them. And they gave me this glass, look at that. Look at these glasses. It's got like power, power inside, power patterns. Pork buns and lamb buns from, um, from Mama Farm. Mama Farm. I probably put it, <laughs> the word, but I will put their link as well. So let's see what they got. Oh, look at that. This one looks like beef. Oh, man. This looks dope. Look at that. Man, so good. Mm. Man, did I say did I tell you guys I was on a diet? I lied. <laughs> no diet here, mate. Food diet. That's what it is. Food diet. But uh, here they got a lamb one. So it's probably the same, just different shape. Look at that. See that? Wow. Wow. This. Mmm. I like that. This is the business. Definitely the business. Tastes great. <laughs> Thanks, my man, fella. <laughs> My man don't want to get in front of the camera. I've been trying to get the Uso to get in front of the camera. He's like, um, you know. So this is their luau. So it comes in this planet. There, as you can see. So this is their palusami, their luau. So. See there? Can you see that? Sorry, I've got the camera on a, on a tripod sort of thing. So, but basically, that's a... Hmm, okay. This is one of my favorite island food. You know, taro leaves and coconut cream with some onions. People put onions in it sometimes. And the Tongans put our meat in it. Lusipi, they call it in Samoan, we call it luau. It's palusami, but I'm sure every Pacific Island have their own version of it. Um, this is great with taro or cassava or yam and stuff like that. Mm. And look what I got, guys. Look at that. I got pudding and um, custard. So pulingi and custard. In Samoa, we call it pulingi and custard. Um, like I said, everybody have, probably have their own version of this. Look at that. Man. Yum. Good dessert. We're here in Hickenburg getting island food. People told me about this spot. They said you need to go there because the place is hectic. It's dope. So that's the reason why we're here. And we're showing you people how they get down over here. So keep your eye on the channel. Thank you for subscribing and supporting the channel. As always, hit that like button. You know how we get down. Lawless Island shop here in uh, Hagenburg, out here, out west. So we're going to check out the food. We're going to go in and we're going to show you people what's cracking at this neck of the woods, especially for island foods. This is the spot. If you're looking to get island food, this is one of the places. So here we're in Lola's Island shop. So you can see in here got the orcas, raw fish for you. And uh, what's that, otai? Yes, it's otai. Yeah, otai, you know. And then the Tongans putting it on. Everything is all saipi around here. So. Like I said, people, today we're doing the content is island food. Where to get island food around uh, West Sydney. And this is definitely one of the spots. Lawless Island food spot. As you can see. Gotta have your coconut creams. And let's see what they got. 
Taro. There's Taro there. Sorry. Place is busy. Taro. Um, yam. I think of some sort. Oh, I got the pork. The pork there. The lamb. So they got the pulingis here. Custard and pudding. Chicken. The fried um, lamb buns. Chopped suey. Today is definitely eating day. We're gonna do a lot of eating today. Island food. So, <laughs> uh, moon, half moon pies. Uh, is this, um, what's this one? Is this German bun or? German, German bun. German bun, so we get buns here, right? Uh, lamb buns. Lamb. So, how long have you guys at this store here? Um, we've been around here five years now. Yeah. Just in the June, June 1st. Oh, nice. June, sorry. And uh, uh, what's, what's your background, Tongan? We're Tongan. Yeah, all good. Fifi Aki. Okay. All safe bear in the hood here. We're here in the place, you know, this is where you get island food. Come and check out our lawless island food place here out in uh, Hickenburg. Uh, it is run, it's a Tongan uh, run store. So it's great island food out west. Definitely worth the, you know, worth the, worth the trip to come to lawless island food place out here in Hickenburg. So let's get to it. Let's get to it, people. So yes, we got a few bits and pieces here, a few food here, the buns, we want to get some, some of those moon pies. And we also got raw fish. We'll show you from Lola's uh, food place here. Thank you very much. What's that? Cutlery. Oh, cutlery, okay. So we got our food. We're going to move on to the next door and then we'll sit down and um, do a lot of eating. And show you so food. up next, we have this deep fried uh, lamb bun and um, a steamed lamb bun. So this, this is from Lola's Island Shop. So as you can see, there. Mm. Mmm, nice. And also, there was uh, fried. Got this fried, um, fried um, lamb bun. So it's basically the same as steam bun, but it's fried, deep fried. Mmm. Wow. It's really nice. Good food. It's really nice. I was looking at this, I was drooling when I saw this. Look at look at it. Look at look at look at that. And this is lamb. Let me break let me break some of this lamb off. Look at that. Mmm. Really nice. And you know, we can't go without having our island taro. There, taro. There's taro. Taro and, co taro and coconut cream. Mmm. It's a staple diet for us. Now, all from the same shop, Lordless. Island food, and look, from Lola's Island food comes a hookah, which is raw fish, and um, my man said, wait, raw fish got a bit of a kick to it, it's got a bit of chili in it. The raw fish had a bit of a chili in it, so... <laughs> I'm sure they got ones without chili, but we managed, we, we got the one with chili. You know, because we wanted a bit of spice, spice in our lives. So, taro. And the chili flavored raw fish, oka. It's 
get a, you know, it's got cucumbers, tomatoes. As your Americans say, tomato, but we say tomatoes. And raw fish. The business. This is the business. Raw fish is the business. I like spice. We also got one of these, we call it moon pies. Uh, I think it's in, in Samoan we call it pie fella, which basically means pineapple pie. And this, so we're gonna break, let's, let's break a little bit off. Oh, yes, yes. So you can see inside, inside there. Wow, yum. I love, I used to love this. I still do. Hmm. Stop it. Cut it out. Oh, Lola. Why you gotta go and make good pies like this? Now I have to come visit your shop every weekend. Man, this is <laughs> this is the business. Top mark, so make sure you go see Lola. Lola's Island Food over in Hickenburg, uh, close to Liverpool, if you're out in Southwest Sydney. It is the business. Definitely, it's the business. Wow. Wow.